Okay, this is after you turn off the main road. This is the driveway that takes you into the camp. The camp was built about 60 years ago. It was built back in the time where they built real log cabins by hand with no special tools other than a, uh, a chainsaw to cut down the magnificent spruce pine trees that they used to build these cabins. This camp was at one time called Clark's Camp. Matter of fact, my uh, family stayed at Clark's Camp back in the 60s. It was considered a luxurious camp. It was considered uh, the Rolls Royce of camps in this area. It offered not only magnificent fishing, but it also offered beautiful cabins, fireplaces, kitchens, and also what they call the American plan, which is where you have your meals served to you in the main lot, which we'll get to in a couple minutes here. This road is a total of nine-tenths of a mile long. The area we're going through right now is called Crown Land. And it was harvested for the trees about eight or ten years ago. These are all new growth trees. We're, now we're just approaching the entrance <clears throat> to the actual 13 acres. Okay, here's the entrance gate. This is after you've gone about seven or eight tenths of a mile down a dirt road off of the main road. So talk about privacy and seclusion. It doesn't get any more private than this. Steve King is the proud owner of this 13 acres with a lodge and three beautiful renovated cabins. And we're pulling into the lodge area. I'm going to show you in the inside just how nice it is.